Welcome to Holding the Silence from St James's Church, Piccadilly. You'll find the words of the office on the church website under Holding the Silence. And if you ask me what a Christian is, I'd say, not him who is pure in word and deed, or goes to all the Sunday services, or says his prayers, or knows the proper creed. But that one who would gladly give away all that he has now, or has ever been, to stand between the dark tomb and the day, and know the moment of the Magdalene. O oh Lord, open our lips, and our mouths shall proclaim your praise. Reveal among us the light of your presence, you who are common to all. Great Spirit, whose breath is felt in the soft breeze and whose life surges through socket and screen, we seek your strength in the midst of the day. May we and all the peoples of the world work in dignity and walk in the beauty of the day. Amen. Canticle Blessed are you, Creator God, who dreamed of humankind and brought us into being. From before the foundation of the world, to the end of time and the mystery beyond. That we should become whole, transfigured and made holy by your presence. In Christ, you have freed us at great cost that we too may absorb great evil and live. The spirit of forgiveness flows in our veins. Retaliation and vengeance wither away. The riches of your grace are a sumptuous feast. All mankind is invited to your table. But you have made known to us the mystery of your will, the purpose to unite all things in Christ, the ceaseless web of matter and energy through the earth and the stars of the universe, so that all may resound in heavenly music from the glory to glory forever. Amen. Spirit of wisdom, take from us all fuss, the clattering of noise, the temptation to dominate by the power of words, the craving for certainty. Lead us through the narrow gate of not knowing, that we may listen and obey, and come to a place of silence and stillness of true conversation and wisdom. Cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. Discipline yourself, keep alert. Like a roaring lion, your adversary, the devil, prowls around, looking for someone to devour. Resist him, steadfast in your faith, for you know that your brothers and sisters in all the world are undergoing the same kinds of suffering. Wisdom. 
when we lose God in the modern world, we lose four key things. Meaning, purpose, responsibility and accountability. We will now keep 10 minutes of silence together.
Christ, you are risen from the dead. We are risen with you. May our life never deny this eternal life, this peace and hope and joy. Praise and glory to the God of life, who is stronger than all kinds of death. Alleluia. Amen. As the community of St James's Piccadilly, a part and part of the whole, in isolation and in communion, near and far, together we pray. For the earth and its peoples, and all life, for all those who are about to be born, and those on the edge of death. For all those who are sick and those who look after them, we pray for our communities, our families and loved ones. We pray that Christ may flow through us and into the world to his glory. Risen Christ, by the lakeside you renewed your call to your disciples. Help your church to obey your command and draw the nations to the fire of your love. To the glory of God the Father. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and for ever. Amen. May God, who raises us, show us compassion and love. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you for joining me.